trying to make a video. How to fit a closed couple. How to fit a closed couple toilet. Yeah. Step one, empty the bag and find your fittings. First up, you'll need this. Separate the nut and ring and then put this side inside the toilet. Poke it so the ring is popping through the hole. Then put your ring on this end. And then tighten on your nut. I set mine, my flushing mechanism, at this angle so I have access to both holes for putting the retaining bolts through, which will be explained later. Next up, adjustable grips and tighten up the nut. Hand tighten it and then tighten it a couple more. Do not over tighten it because you will crack it. Next up, split your retaining nuts. Nut washer goes inside, ring nut outside. Put these in before you put the fill valve in because it makes your life easier. Next up, bolts are through, so we're going to put this in. Same again, rubber on the inside, nut and ring on the outside. Again, hand tight and then nip up. It's a plastic ring and a rubber. So, the next biggest tip I'll get you is these holes here. Make sure you connect your flexi-fill connection on first. Otherwise, it'll be a nightmare to do it afterwards. Again, it's a rubber, so hand tight and then a wee nip up. That's all you need. Next up, we'll have the rubber grommet. This, sit this on here and it'll sit nicely. And then we're going to sit this on top of this, like so. Like you, hold this and try and get me doing this. So next up, you're going to be looking like this. Flex is down, fit is down. Now you want to connect up your nuts and bolts. Which is just... These two. Just want to add, wash it first, then the nut. Again, hand tight on both sides and then nip up as tight as you can with your hands. You don't want to overdo this and snap it. As you can see, I've left access to the fin. So I can do this. And put pressure on it while I'm doing the nut. Again, I'm gonna really tighten this hand tight. Mm -hmm. Next up, I'm going to connect this onto here. So we're going to cut this down to about here. There ain't no in this river. In this marching map. I just love the rubber. Huh? I've done that. Yeah, and what, the bit that goes into the 4 inch? Mm -hmm. Right, shake it up. Went over the Went over it with water. Oh, I've got to tilt You're actually standing in the light. Oh, shit. I do also recommend putting paste on your nuts and alls. It stops that screw noise you just heard. Next up, you want your pan connector. See, I'm using the Flexi PanCon from Viva Sanitary, but what I like to do is I like to lube up both ends. It makes it easier to push onto the pan, and then it makes it easier to slide onto the outlet for the waste, which is just in cut flush with this wall. Look 
Passing on the flame to Scott to gaze a run through in the toilet seat. Piece of cake, pal. What you say? <laughs> Some of the peel is done, it's not just plumbing that I think it's really like some stupid and funny little really. so, Folks ain't like that. I'm fine there, man. I don't know, you're the one that's fucking well, doing the demonstration. I think it's fine, but can you shut that? It hangs over the pan. I mean, that's fine. Because it's an edge. Are you happy? I, I like the inside, I just don't like the outside, it just hangs over. Can you get it back any further? I'll push it back as far as you can kind of get it. When you're back to the army, anyway. Hmm? When you're back to the army. We've got until the 10th, 10th of January. Put the seat on. 